I started doing Sunday sketches in December of 2015 because I needed to integrate a regular drawing habit into my weekly routine. And at the time, I treated them as visual diary entries, wherein I would create stylized paintings of photos that I took in the past. But I wasn't uploading them online because I found them a little bit too literal for my taste. And at the time, I didn't have an Instagram account. It was around April of 2017. That was when I started uploading my Sunday sketches on my website because I needed to see that visual of sketches accumulating to prompt me to keep making more. And then later that year, I decided to exhibit at the local Comic Con because I had my first short story comic book. And the preparations that I did for that event made me realize that I probably should create an Instagram account because I thought people would likely be asking me where they can find me online and people don't really go to websites these days unless they're looking for more details and by that time I've actually developed a different way of composing my Sunday sketches so instead of slices of life instead of literal depictions of what was happening to me at the time like a leaky faucet that's been bothering me for days my Sunday sketches turned into something more of a visual metaphor of what I was trying to remember or what I was thinking about at the time now in this particular Sunday sketch I was actually walking towards the swimming pool that day. It was summertime. I had my backpack and I was wearing my running clothes. Now the swimming pool is just a few blocks away from my place. So I was walking and along the sidewalk there was this parked car. And when I passed by the car, the driver pulled down the window in the front passenger seat and called out to me to ask for directions. And the moment I saw that driver, I realized that he was trying to appear like something he's not. But he did have a straightforward question and I happened to know the answer to it, so I gave him directions. He wanted to know where the track and field was, which struck me as funny because he was wearing a dress. But I thought maybe he had a change of clothes. And then he asked me if I was going there myself so that he can give me a ride to the place. I said, no, I'm not going there. I'm going over there. And I pointed to the swimming pool. And then he asked me, oh, could I go there in my birthday suit? Now, he actually didn't say birthday suit, but that's what he meant. And so I said, no, actually they have very strict rules over there about wearing swimming costumes and so he said can I ask you a question which is quite funny because that was what he was doing so far and so I nodded and said yes and he said do you think these are too big and then he grabbed his chest and so I looked at his chest and I said, they look fine. They're just the right size. And then he asked me, could I be your friend? And by that time I couldn't stop laughing. I said, this is too weird. And I started walking away. Now, my weeks aren't always this eventful. Most weeks are pretty normal. But occasionally, I do get to spend some time with a real friend in person. Alright, I'll see you in the next video.